testimony. Amen. Hope y'all blessed in Bible study. Amen. Yes. Uh, uh, I know uh, uh, Pastor John, uh, we were, uh, 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 do we have the business field or do you want to carry on what you got to study? Okay, all right, praise God, amen. Uh, but I would ask, I will be here this Wednesday, God's will, Terry is coming, and we will take the last five minutes. I get five minutes. All I want to talk about is May. Amen? I'm not recording a full calendar. I just want to make sure May is our church anniversary. Okay, I want to make sure everything we locked out in May for our church anniversary, amen? amen. And uh, also to all the business staff, amen, please come with your plans for the month of May. And, uh, for what we're going to do for the church anniversary. Somebody say amen. amen. So let's lock this in so we can keep doing a good job. Uh, thank the brothers for the paint job. Change the paint job in the back in the hallway. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Yeah, it looks 100% better. Mm -hmm. I don't know about you, but to amen. Me, it looks 100% better. So thank God for that. And uh, uh, But one thing we do want to talk about Wednesday, so uh, we do want to get this locked in because we got to get this locked in. Somebody say amen. amen. So, uh, all right, so do that. Now, you ready to read? Yes. Amen. Now remember now, you, you're not just saying words. This is the word of God. Amen. And all you got to do is obey. Mm -hmm. Look at the name said. All you got to do Amen. is obey. obey. How hard is that? How hard is that? Amen. <laughs> amen. All you got to do is obey. Amen. So say amen. amen. And all you got children is all you tell them, right? And you should not want to say all you gotta do is listen to me. Did I tell you that? So, 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 yeah, I don't understand you wrong. I'm trying to get you to avoid something that I that don't already been through. You need to listen to me. What are you trying to get them to do? Amen. Obey, right? Obey. Somebody say amen. Amen. Praise the Lord, amen. And then they keep on with this bitch. You get your belt out and do what? Right? <laughs> Amen. Because you want them to what? Obey. And you know there's a blessing in doing what? Obedience. Obedience. And that's all this is asking you to do. Is to what? Obey the word of God. Amen. And he asks you to preach. And he asks you to get enough walking into the fivefold column. Am I saying amen? Amen. And not asking you to do any of that. All it asks you to do, obey. And come God's I will to bless you. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. All right, let's read it. And then uh, we read responsibly. On count of three. One, two, three, here we go. And it shall come to pass. And thou shalt hearken do so to the Lord of the Lord thy God, to observe and to do all his commandments. I command thee this day that the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. And all these blessings shall come on thee and overtake thee if thou shalt hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. Blessed shall not be in the city, and blessed shall not be in the field. Blessed shall be the fruit of thy body, and the fruit of thy ground, and the fruit of thy cattle, the increase of thy kind, and the flocks of thy sheep. Blessed shall be thy basket in thy store. Blessed shall I be when I go within, and blessed shall I be when I go without. The Lord shall cause thy enemy to rise up against thee, be smitten for thy face. They shall come out against thee one way, and flee before thee seven ways. The Lord shall command the blessing upon thee in thy storehouses, and all that thou set in thy hand unto. And he shall bless thee in the land which the Lord thy God giveth thee. The Lord shall establish thee as a holy people unto himself, as he has sworn to thee, if thou shalt keep the commandment of the Lord thy God, and walk in his ways. And all the people of the earth shall see that thou art called by the name of the Lord, and they shall be afraid of thee. And the Lord shall make thee pretty in goods, in the fruit of thy body, and in the fruit of thy cattle, and in the fruit of thy ground, in the land with the Lord swear to thy fathers to give thee. The Lord shall open unto thee his good treasure, the heaven to give the rain unto thy land in the season, and to bless all the work of thy hand, and thou shalt lend unto many nations, and thou shalt not borrow. And the Lord shall make thee the head and not the tail. And thou shalt be above only, and thou shalt not be beneath. If that thou hearken unto the commandments of the Lord thy God, which I command thee this day to observe and to do them all, and thou, thou shalt not go aside from any, any other words, I, I command thee this day to the right hand or to the left, to go after the other gods, gods to serve them. them. Now stay on your feet and turn your paper over. And these are literally prayers to activate God's covenant 
in your life. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Am I saying that? Amen. So we don't let me pray. So if you ain't praying today, you're going to pray right now. Is that all right? Amen. And we're going to do it together on that count of three. One, two, three. Let, Let me diligently listen to and obey the voice of the Lord your God, being careful to do all his commandments. Let your blessings come upon me and overtake me. Let me be blessed in the city and blessed in the field. Let the fruit of my body be blessed. And let all the fruit of my labor be blessed. Let my basket and store be blessed. Let me be blessed coming in and blessed going out. Let the image of my soul be free before me seven ways. Command your blessing upon my storehouse and all I set my hands to and bless my land. Establish me as a holy person unto you, Lord. Let all people see that I am called by your name. Make me plenteous in goods. Open unto me your good treasures. And let heaven's rain fall upon my life and bless the work of my hand. Let me live, give unto many nations and not borrow. Make me the head and not the tail. Let me be above only and not beneath. Let not be turned aside from any word which I have been commanded to me today. God bless you. Give God your praise. What a powerful prayer you pray today. Amen. And a powerful word you declare over your life. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.